talk about you know, that I'm into politics, the same mm-hmm. politics. But I should not discuss uh, just a little bit. Uh, you know, because I have friends on Twitter that are Democrat and have some who are, are Republicans, you know, have people I follow. So you kind of see how they do, you know, <laughs> you know how the one side is and how the other side is. <laughs> kind of, they could kind of see, you know, in many ways, they're pretty alike. <laughs> Yeah, but I can see that. Yeah, I, like, I love that. I love observing things. That's why you know, I'm like on the internet a lot. I observe things. People will like reveal themselves more on the internet than they would. Like, you know, passion them in the street. You know, they'll the internet is like a shrink. You know, it's like they'll start to like rant and say things, and they would not not only say you know, in real life. And so you get to know people better. It's like you want to get to know people, learn about people. Go on the internet. <laughs> you know, because people have feel they have this little bit of security there being on the internet behind the computer so they so so trolls come out and they can you know these people are mean people to begin with so they just now they can say things without like repercussions so you kind of go no this this trolls are really good people they there's no misunderstood now they're they just want to be mean they're mean people who want us to say mean things i mean i can understand why people become mean you get so hatred of stuff people and i i get it you know i get you just want to just hate on everybody and it's because people are mean to i i understand that but i'm still saying you know They be are there. They they become more their real selves on the internet. And you guys go, oh, no, that's the, yes, yeah, that's the more their real selves. I remember one time I said like, no, people just kind of unwinding and you know they're not really they they're being their real selves. Like yeah, they being their real selves. This is their real selves. <laughs> yeah, or maybe they have trolls just to like get attention. And all of a sudden when they get attention, then they're all nice or something. No, 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 I'm just a misunderstood guy. But no. You understand me, so we can be friends out. <laughs> or something like that. Yeah. But you know, yeah, so that's why well, I don't know. It's like when I was a kid, there wasn't any internet, and, and I was writing songs, and I, there was never, I was like, what do I write about? I don't know, don't really know people, because they kind of, I do they are, you know, it's like they don't really say who they are, so you, but then I don't want to write about people I know, because people I know kind of, you know, you know they suck, but <laughs> for the most part, well, they're not impressive. They don't. It's like I, I've never written a song about someone that I actually know. Because it's like, why well, do I write about someone? Someone who would I write about? I, I can't think of anyone. I know that. Okay, there's there's some people who are very kind to us in my, my family, so I can write about them. So kindness was kind of about that because they're very kind. Some kind of kind people, like my dad's doctor, is very kind lady. So you know, kindness. It's kind of she was kind of. Let's talk about her a little bit. She's very she's kind. Yeah, you, know, you know, people are kind for whatever reason. But you know, I don't know why. But they, you know, it is what it is. So you know, but um, you know, but I never write songs about people that I actually know. <laughs> it's just like, why would I do that? I can't think of anybody I know that's like really impressive because I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> people like people on the internet. I, I mean, the people on the internet. I'm not impressed by any of them. <laughs> they don't. They don't do anything for me. <laughs> It's like, you know, I mean, even on Twitter, all you people you follow on Twitch, or, I don't know, these people, it's not like these people who are giving me compliments or, or like telling me. You know, I, I love that when you see like these, like, someone's like, I'm very, very attractive to, to, today. And then they're like, no, you're so beautiful. And then all those people got like, commenting, they got comment. No, you're so beautiful, though. Oh, yeah. And see all this that comes. You're so beautiful, though. You know, they, they're like fishing for comments when they kind of insult themselves. You know what I mean? That, that kind of obvious kind of, I'm fishing for compliments by, by insulting myself, and you're obviously going to tell me that I'm pretty because, of, hey, especially these women and the women kind of thing, they always got to be like giving them each other compliments. You always see guys going, hey, man, you look good. You, you're totally money. Remember <laughs> from the last movie swimmers? <laughs> yeah, no, guys, always, always the women who get the compliments. Guys giving women compliments, women giving women compliments. They get all the compliments. That's why they're so nice and stuff, and they don't stop. <laughs> like, well, women, they. They will never start work. Women will judge. It's like, yeah, because you guys are like happier because you always get compliments. <laughs> now, if men got comp- more compliments, maybe, maybe we'd be nicer, you know, <laughs> right? <Yeah. laughs> but you know, it's like, like whenever there's people complaining about stuff, like in stores and stuff, it's always it's more women who complain, or you know, like complain about things. I like that. Then men, why is that? It's like women are so gay and kind. But they'll complain about things. <laughs> men, men will just kind of deal with it themselves. They just don't feel it's important enough to 
to like you know to argue to like to like complain about it it's like get off get over it <laughs> you know but yet people will be like oh man this star world all the time it's an interesting thing that I don't know it's like everyone wants to give my man but when, even, when people insult man we don't actually get hurt by it we kind of deal with it it's like people are like man drug it's like but we don't get hurt by it because we're very secure <laughs> ourselves we know we, are, we know we're awesome we know we're the alphas we know we rule but we you know we gotta be like yeah okay we, we suck that's fine because cause we're secure people who are secure you know don't get hurt <laughs> if I'm secure I know I am and you can insult me I don't, I don't get hurt by that because I know it's not true yes usually when people get insulted and they get hurt by it because they feel yeah, maybe they're right that's when you know when someone's insecure you know when you're here because you feel they might be right and then I bet and then yeah well I'm gonna talk that's when I get some video on you so I'm talking and stuff and so I can watch this later and just kind of enjoy it kind of enjoy myself <laughs> yeah it's like I'm on most of the time I'm on the internet I'm like watching my own videos because I'm like the the most entertaining and talented person I know, so I'm like, might as well want to get to enjoy myself, you know. It's like, I, I don't know. I wish I had a twin, and maybe my twin would be as cool as I, and I can just enjoy myself till my twin, you know what I mean? But now, eh, it sucks to be able to. <laughs> I am just, just one of me. So I can record a video of myself so I can enjoy myself. Like, what are you doing on the internet? Then I'm watching myself in my videos. I enjoy my videos. I make these videos so I can enjoy myself. Enjoy watching myself and entertaining myself. And people talk about being bored. It's like, you know, it's like I'm hardly ever bored. The only time I become bored is if I put my entertainment into the hands of someone else. I mean, if I go into like a, a site and go, okay, someone's going to be, let me watch someone who's entertaining here. Or you know, on Twitter or whatever, someone's gonna post something, something entertainment, and a lot of times they don't. And you go, okay, now I'm bored because I'm putting my hand in someone else's, my entertainment, in someone else's hand. And they're not doing the job. But now if I just put the, my entertainment in my own hands, I can entertain myself. <laughs> I can be entertaining. <laughs> so uh, you know, so that's the only way I can become bored is if I put my hands and put my entertainment in the hands of someone else who isn't entertaining <laughs> you know what I mean some people are very entertaining you know what I mean some people can oh, I have a natural you know I can read their stuff and it's entertaining I'm like that's cool that's funny you know like, would you, like Ricky Gervais he's a funny guy I like reading his tweets I wish he tweeted more but you know him and his David Brent uh, you know also Paige it's funny some stuff you know he's <laughs> it's funny stuff he's a See, he's a guy I enjoy. He's funny and he's, you know, he's, he's cool. And he can laugh at himself. He's funny because he, because he knows how to laugh at himself. I think a comedian, a lot of these comedians can't laugh at themselves. They kind of get angry, like Chevy Chase. He, if you like a joke, if you make a joke about it, he gets all angry. He's, <laughs> he, you know, he can't, he can't take the joke, but he can dish. Yeah, that's his way. But Ricky Gervais, he can take a joke. He can, you know, he saw them back. He, he can take it, and he actually laughs. You know, you know, or some of these other guys that can take a joke back. And I can I appreciate those kind of comedians who are like can take the joke. It can be you know, if someone attacks them, they can take it. So uh, Yeah, but there's a few a few other people who are very who I enjoy. Who are naturally entertaining. That's who else is entertaining. Uh, there are some entertaining people. They don't, they don't post enough, but they can be kind of, yes, they kind of funny stuff on there. So, okay. I like when people post a lot on Twitter, because I'm always reading something. I'm always reading stuff, so they post a lot. I think a lot of them don't want to post a lot, because they feel like they're blow. I guess the term is they're blowing up someone's news feed. It's like, because mm -hmm. they, they, they think someone's going to be like, you post too much, and I hate you for it. <laughs> it's like, is that the point of the thing? The post? I like them when people post because then they're being interesting and then I can read the stuff and when I go on there I can always read the stuff and see what's going on they post pictures of themselves it's like obviously if I follow you I like you so I want to I wouldn't mind seeing pictures of you or you telling me your opinions of it. I don't mind that except for some of the political stuff 
it's like I don't care about politics. So when people talk about politicians, I just it's like it's like someone talking about shoes. I just don't care about shoes, so I don't want really to hear about shoes. But I'm not gonna hate you for it. <laughs> if you enjoy f- shoes, go on about shoes. Or or who else? Or oh, else what do people enjoy? You know, I enjoy ice cream. Go on about ice cream. Or I don't know. No, but people don't really go on about things that they enjoy. Have you noticed that people will always just go on about things that they hate? People they hate. It's like whenever I post on Twitter, it's always things that I like. People, I'll post a McCartney album. I'll post my stuff. It's everybody. Every, all my posts is people being creative, me being creative, or someone else being creative, or things that I enjoy, or me posting ideas I'm thinking of, because it's interesting and creative. I'm thinking, ah, climate change. I'm noticing it. See, I'm being interesting. Everything I post, I will not retweet anything, because that's not original. Occasionally, I will retweet a Beatles thing, because they're awesome. They deserve. If any band deserves to be like, retweeted, it's the Beatles. Because that's awesome. See, that's why that's what I do. I, I will only post things that are enjoyable. My stuff, things that bring art into the world. The Beatles, the Queen, all the stuff, songs. But then everybody else posts like stuff about people that they hate. It's like, why do you want to focus on people that you hate? Why do you want to think about it? It's like, it's like eating something that you don't enjoy. It's like, why you want to force yourself to eat something that you don't enjoy? It's the same thing. <laughs> think about people that you don't enjoy, eating things that you don't enjoy, going places where that you don't enjoy. It's because you, you like the pain. <laughs> it's what it is. <laughs> it's like, no, oh, I must... We must fight that evil. It's like, you know, you're not going to defeat the evil, but just talking about someone, you're going to give them power. The more you talk about them, the more power they get. The more people are going to be thinking about them, then they're going to be in people's heads. And, no, they're not all wrong. That's why these people keep existing, because you people don't know how to, like, how to fight these things. <laughs> you people just know how to keep them going, because <laughs> you guys just don't know. <laughs> no. It's like, it's almost like, it's almost like nature wants you to be wrong, so... So that we will always have problems. So we have things to like, you know, confront <laughs> to, to keep us busy and interested in life. You know, imagine if we had no bad things happening and no bad, no be people who suck. And I'll be like, what do we fight now? What what do we do? <laughs> what do? We, what do? <laughs> so I, that's why I think that 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 exists. That people, you know, like just don't do things right exist because it's like we have to try to overcome them. <laughs> that's basically. The meaning of life, a part of life, to overcome that. Yeah, that's what I. Yeah.